Okay. Pancake. Milkshake. Pancake. <laughs> Games like Torum Online needs utility characters because without it, earning Spina can be a hassle. You are presented with two options. One is either you waste more slots on utility characters or make a single 8 in 1 utility character. One will you choose? Isn't that fascinating? Well, I think the answer is quite clear. Choosing 8 in 1 character will be logical, right? Since reset event is here, making it a very easy process. This is our ultimate 8 in 1 character. You need a retired character. The one that is gathering dust and you haven't played since the making. You need that character for the reset event. I know you may be emotionally connected with the character. It's okay. But trust me, this can also help you make a big spinner in game. Basically we need 3 skill trees. Blacksmith, Alchemist, Tamer and we can include Fishing also. Utility characters don't play in the game or do not fight but rather they help outside the battle. We can process materials, define equips, create equipments as well as customize equipment. As you can see, I have a very high blacksmith proficiency as well as high level. This will help us in stacking. Same goes with alchemy panel. We can process material, synthesize items, synthesize equipment as well as save color equips now. I also have a very high proficiency but you need around 150 for lock 4 only. Let us look at the skills now. Basically I have every level 10 of refine as well as all the proficiency and mat reduction skills. These are very essential and you have to have 10 on it. Now I use proc material level 10 star gem that's why you can see I have not given any sort of skills in here. If you want, you can allot or else you don't need to allot at all. I have also taken every alchemy skill that is available in game. Now let us look at the tamer skills. I have level 10 star gems that's why I haven't taken much tamer skills. As you can see I have taming capture technique 1 as well as skillful capture level 10 star gem with me. This helps me a lot and saves me a lot of skill points. Let us review the different functions that it can perform. First one is processing material, then second one is refining equipments and gears, this is my favorite. Then third one is creating high port with armor, as you can see I have achieved 118 points. Next is starting then comes creating potions and item, this helps you a lot. Then sixth is fetching and saving colors, it will help you save a lot of colors that you get during the events. Now 7th is lock for synthesizing, it is an essential task and every beginner must have it. And last one is catching pets. It is my favorite task as you can catch a lot of good pets and have it at your house. Now the bonus part that is catching fishes, well you can catch fishes with any build. That's all about my build, hope you like it, until next time, see ya.